survey of 29,967 drivers shows 16.8% of EV owners reported breakdowns in the last 24 months. Now compare that to 10.7% for petrol cars, 14.1% for hybrids, and 15.4% for diesel. So yes, technically EVs do have the highest breakdown rate. But here's what Tony's missing. There's a massive variation between EV models. You see the Mini Electric scored 98.4% reliability with just 5% of owners reporting faults. And meanwhile, the MG4 scored 63.8% with 30% of owners reporting an issue. Now that's not that all EVs are unreliable, but there are some manufacturers that haven't figured out the quality control, unfortunately. Floats that were surveyed and had a breakdown. One in six. And then the article goes on to say that this backs up what the CEO of AA, Jacob Perforder, said in April. And let go back to more videos in April because I covered this subject with a video where um, Jacob Perforder said, it's really weird, but um, we attend more breakdowns to EVs than we do to anything else. And the milk floatery were apoplectic with rage. They could not... <laughs> so Tony is referencing Jacob Fowler. I think I'm pronouncing his name right, from the AA correctly here. The AA did confirm in April 2025 that EVs break down slightly more often than petrol and diesel vehicles, but the what car data shows why. Now, looking at the fault categories, you've got non-motor electrics, basically software issues, sat-nav and infotainment problems. Then you've got 12 volt battery failures, but you notice what's not really top in the failure list, electric motors and drive batteries. You see the Nissan Leaf, for example, just had an 11% fault rate, mostly interior trim and brakes, nothing EV specific. Believe such blasphemy. The head of the AA saying that their beloved vehicles break down more than anybody else's. He was only saying what facts he'd been given, and he was only telling the truth. But, as we know full well, the truth has no place in 2025 in the world. Because everything is manipulated. As I stated yesterday in my video, the entire world is manipulated into telling you what you need to hear, not what you want to hear. Jacob Perforder said that. What car have carried out a survey? 30,000 drivers and come to the same conclusion. 